The commitment of 2018 four-star athlete Jordan Moore to Texas A&M on Christmas Eve is certainly the biggest news of the day in football recruiting, but if everything breaks the right way, he could be the gift that keeps on giving for the Aggies. As many people know, Jordan is one half of the Moore twins from Yoakum, Texas, and his brother Joshua is also a member of the Rivals 250 in the 2018 class. Naturally, there has been a lot of speculation since the two became high-profile recruits over the spring that they would want to continue playing together for the same team at the college level. Now with Jordan committed to the Aggies, that is a big step for Texas A&M and possibly landing another four-star prospect down the road. When I talked to Jordan, he said that he picked the Aggies in part because looking ahead to his freshman or sophomore season in College Station, it seemed as though he would have the best shot at some early playing time relative to some of the other schools in his top five, which were Michigan, Ohio State, Oklahoma, and Texas. But A&M is also relatively close to his hometown, and after a couple of visits there this season, he said he fell in love with the atmosphere and the relationship he's built with the coaching staff. Moore said that he expects that his best fit with the Aggies will be on the offensive side of the ball, which isn't necessarily expected, but it's not surprising either. I think I expected him to go more the way of a defensive prospect, but the natural comparison to his brother, who looks more the part of a traditional wide receiver, might have something to do with that too. When you think about what you like to see from a guy listed as an athlete that plays on both sides of the ball in high school, it's to see a knack for putting himself around the ball on the play, and that's something Jordan does very well. Both brothers sort of suffer a little bit on the high school level from not having some more talent at the quarterback position, but they still made enough plays this season to lead their team to a state championship appearance, and I think that no matter what, next season we'll see them both featured as playmakers more prominently. In the games that I watched Yoakum play in the state playoffs, I thought Jordan often made the most impactful plays, and wherever his future lies with the Aggies, I expect him to continue that at the college level.